Tracy always gets cupcakes for her birthday. I just saw her with one. We need to go sing to her. You better brush up on modus ponens. You're about to be really embarrassed. Some boys sure are stupid. Are you calling me stupid? You shouldn't be taking that personally. What you need is to understand existential instantiation. Students who love pizza always go to Ziggy's. But I hate pizza, and you're telling me I can't go to Ziggy's? You need to understand implication, or you're going to miss out on some great food. People who win this contest won't be late or sloppy. I'm good. I may be sloppy, but I'm never late. Oops, you'd better learn about De Morgan's laws or find another contest to enter. If you're in line and you've got a ticket, you'll get into the game. Great! I'm first in line. I'm in. Wishful thinking won't get you very far. You'd better get yourself a ticket. Then learn a list of reasoning rules that won't get you into trouble. Uh-oh. I guess we won't be having barbecue tonight. Well, why not? Only service animals can get into the place. I don't think we're dogs. Negation is tricky. You've got to be really clear about the universe of discourse. I think they're talking about which pets are welcome, not which people. Well, Mr. Aristotle, have you stopped blackmailing the Persians? Hmm. But I can't say no. They'll think I'm blackmailing even as we speak. Hmm. But I can't say yes that I've stopped. Then they'll think I've been a blackmailer. Aristotle, you're stuck in a presupposition trap. Let's say you're a good guy. Then the question presupposes something false, namely that you even were a blackmailer. You need to address that head on. Well, do you need to brush up on logic?